it is very important to learn subject and predicate for writing good sentences if you don't have any clear concept about subject and predicate you cannot write a complete sentence in english even you cannot change voices hey dear this is jahangir and today i'm going to talk about subject and predicate so let's jump into it every multi word sentence has two parts subject and predicate what is subject subject is the part of a sentence for which something is said or the subject is the doer of the action the subject part of the sentence contains noun or pronoun what is predicate predicate is the part of a sentence in which something is said about the subject the predicate part of the sentence contains a finite verb or may contains an object or complements here we need to know about finite verb object and complements though this lesson is not about them this is only for illustration purposes what is a finite verb finite verb is a verb which is limited to the tense person and number of the subject means it will change its form according to tense person and number of the subject if the sentence is in present tense the finite verb takes its present form for example they play football if the sentence is in past form the finite verb takes its past form for example they played football if the sentence is in present indefinite tense and the subject is third person and the number is singular then the finite verb takes s or es at its end for example he plays football here he is third person and the number is singular so the finite verb play takes s at its end what is an object object is a person or thing on which the action is done upon or it is the receiver of the action for example he plays football here football is an object because the action play is done upon the football so it is an object what is complement complement means supplement that contributes extra features to improve the sentence for example they play football in the field here in the sentence they is subject play is finite verb football is an object and in the field is complement that gives extra features to the sentence here are some sentences and we have to identify the subject part and the predicate part of the sentence number 1 james writes a story here james is subject because the action writing is done by james and the rest part of the sentence writes a story is predicate because it says something about the subject here writes is a finite verb a story is an object or complement number 2 bird flies in the sky here bird is subject because the action flying is done by the bird the rest part of the sentence flies in the sky is predicate here flies is finite verb in the sky is complement number 3 the students enjoyed the picnic the students is subject and the rest part of the sentence enjoyed the picnic is predicate here enjoyed is finite verb and the picnic is complement we take tea every day in the morning here we is subject take tea every day in the morning is predicate here take is finite verb tea is an object every day in the morning is complement thank you and keep learning